what was the one cantrip you chose? Oh, I didn't choose my spells. Fuck. Oh my god. Last. Hey, you what? wanna you wanna know a pro tip that I learned later? Oh, fuck, what did I do? David, you wanna, <laughs> you wanna hear the pro tip? Yes. Uh, yeah, Eldritch Blast is really fucking good. Alright, so we are currently in the town of our first Hi, welcome for the first ever d and <laughs> Uh, hi, this is my third. <laughs> <laughs> I, oh, also the third. Uh, you guys are about to embark on a campaign called The Lost Mine of Fandelver. Damn, yep. David needs a new chair. Holy shit. <laughs> 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 Except, Holy fuck. All right. Okay. Take a seat. But I sit, like, I turn the chair around, and then... Oh, okay. The yeah, I got like, you. Yeah, like <laughs> so that. you want to rip. So... Yeah. so being a dragonborn, what can you bring to the table? Um, I spit hot acid. Uh, All right. Do you? First, first things yeah. first. You're gonna you're gonna role play voice, or you're just gonna be Jerry voice? No, to... I'm I'm gonna be Jerry voice. Okay. okay. I improvise. All right, back to that. Mm -hmm. All right, King. If... So then, uh, so you two shake hands, right? You just regular shake, Jerry. Just a yeah, firm yeah. handshake. Okay. Yes, now, what can you do? How can we know that you can get the shipment to town without taking off with the loot? There's one thing I learned on my <laughs> life on the high seas. That's loyalty to your crew and your captain. If you choose me, I will name you captain. What okay. type of... What, what sort of fighting style would you say you have that would make you different from that fifth rogue we've interviewed over there? <laughs> How many people okay. are in this bar? I feel attacked. Well, I don't use little baby daggers like rogues. I'd rather cut people in half. I'm out. Straight down the middle. Sorry. Okay. I, I, I forgot something. Alright, straight down the middle, huh? Mm -hmm. Congratulations, King. You're in. The pay is ten gold pieces if you can get our shipment to Fandolin. Mm, Alright. Uh, upon <laughs> hearing ten. King. Good enough. All right, I'll drink to that, you, brother. Then you, then you two shake hands. Mm -hmm. um, upon hearing ten gold pieces, <laughs> I am now in line. Okay. I, I, I uh, noticed uh, that King Nagar was speaking, and I, I also get in line. Okay. Uh, Will and Brian, you still not in line? Yeah. All right. I'm uh, so the line from afar. shots. The, the line the line passes a bit more, and at some point, Gundren says. <laughs> Fuck off! And his and his friend and one of his the two dwarves with him just punches the shit out of this one guy, and he ends up leaving the tavern. Uh, then uh, in the next in the front of the line is uh, I'm gonna assume it's David. Yeah. So then Hang David on. walks up. I leave and I follow the guy that just got punched in the stomach. The guy then walks outside and evaporates. Uh, and if you think what? and you think That's to yourself, hair. if if I see if I take one more step forward. I will not only evaporate, but I will no longer be playing any games with anyone ever again. I go back to line. Thank you. <laughs> he reaches out his hand. Uh, he says, hmm, human. Hu <laughs> ah, fuck, how does he say it? Humans don't live long, but the ones I know all like gold. How, who, what's your name? Admiral Schofield. Admiral. My first name is Ad. My first name is Admiral. <laughs> I think my favorite part is that just sounds like uh, an OC like Cold Steel the Hedgehog. You want to know what it is? I was watching March Madness and there's a guy whose first name is actually Admiral and less. <laughs> All right, Admiral, huh? We had some other royalty in here as well. Admiral. So Admiral's not royalty. It's Navy. Uh, yeah. Oh, oh we have the full have navy here as well. Okay. That doesn't mean he's a sailor, Jerry. It's just his name is Admiral. My name is just Admiral. <laughs> Jerry's convinced everybody's a sailor. All right, Admiral. I've seen plenty of humans. What makes you think we could use you on our adventure? I. Uh... All right, hold on. Are you doing role play voice or David voice? I don't know how to role play voice. Just, just make a, a voice, voice, and that's your voice through the entire campaign. I, I need to mute myself really quick. Wow, no shit. Remember I said prepare for stuff? <laughs> I'll just do David voice. Okay, got it. It's a pleasure to meet you. Um, well, it's a pleasure to meet you. Uh, uh, it's a pleasure to meet you. Devil, and uh, I seek... Uh... Amen, brother. 
Probably. World destroying power. This is on. Well, I'm not quite sure you know what this job is for. We're trying to get a, cra a, a caravan of provisions to the frontier town of Phandalin. Are you sure your world destroying powers will be found there? I cannot guarantee this. If anyone on the world tries to take that crate, I'll get them. You know what? I like the cut of your jib. Ten gold pieces when the when the provisions are delivered. And he reaches out his hand again. I'll, I'll just shake it like a normal person. Uh, and then next up is uh, I guess Tyler. You two in line yet? Two other people? No. They're getting shit faced. Okay. Uh, he walks. Uh, he walks and says, "Ah, you're, surprisingly, you're the first elf we've seen. How, what can we do for you? Or how can I help? Would you like?" He reaches out his hand. I look at him like, are you having a stroke? <laughs> the, he's not speaking in that voice, which means this is all internal. <laughs> boy, I, I just got lost. Whoo, boy. Uh, fucking, uh. He says, you're wearing a, you wear armor or no, Tyler? You're a wizard, right? So you're not. No. Which means you're wearing regular clothes. It's a uh, it's which... a blue and white skirt with a red bow. He's only wearing a skirt, so his tits are just hanging out. <laughs> okay, no, well, okay, that's just the clothes. out. That's what you can see outwardly. Then you don't see my tits. <laughs> Ooh, are you <laughs> wearing a shirt? <laughs> Underneath it. He looks at you and says, "Hmm, I <laughs> see." As long as I've been around, you can never tell with elves. Sometimes they look like dainty, quiet things, but on the inside they can be true monsters. Gundren Rockseeker, how do you do? And he reaches his hand out. It's a pleasure, and I and hold he goes, out. He goes, and they start flexing. And uh, I hold out my hand daintily, so now he's just crushing my hand, or trying to. Uh, he, he, shakes, he shakes your hand yeah. like a true gentleman. Yeah, meow, meow, meow. Uh, he says, so, what's your name, miss? Anoi Yasag. I like how he does the dumb pronunciation. Well, that's quite a name. I've seen, so far, I've seen a dragonborn who can, who looks like he could crush you in half. Crush you in half? Tear you in half. <laughs> and a human who apparently made a deal with the devil. But I'm not sure if he wants people to know that. What can you bring to this table? Well, I might not look it, but I'm actually a bounty hunter and a wizard. And a wizard. Wow. <laughs> Only if bounty hunting was a class. Uh, a bounty hunter, huh? Tyler's a little What smart sort of bounties have you taken in? I hate it. <laughs> Many. I, I mean, I'm pretty young, but I was one of the best in the town where I'm from. I'm looking for numbers here. Numbers? What's your number? Currently, it's 24. 24. Yeah, that's way too high for a bounty hunter, Tyler. You should have done research. <laughs> that sounds formidable. So you're a wizard, you say? Have you have you prepared to study in a certain school? Of course. Has hey, psych your level one? You don't have a school. Dumb I'm leader. prepared to study in one. I know what I'm choosing. I just like fucking with them. All right then. Is ten gold gonna be suitable for your high or your high elf self? Yeah, that'll be fine. I'm not really interested in the money anyway. All right then, you're in. He reaches out his hand again. Just, just. Hello. No. Okay. Is anyone going to step into the line? You nerve herders. <laughs> well, I think you're. Okay, then the three brothers get up and leave. All right, everyone who. Yeah, uh, Will's mic's to the brothers, muted. Uh, Will's trying to talk. His mic's muted. Muted. He can't Still hear muted. me. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, hello? I've been trying to figure out my camera this whole time. <laughs> so, so, can I walk up and talk to them? <laughs> sure, while well, someone doesn't know how the fucking microphone works. <laughs> oh, there <laughs> it is. Hey, uh, dumbass! <laughs> great fucking job! <laughs> okay, so, uh, you walk up, Brian? 
Yeah, my, this is gonna be one of voice. Okay, uh, he's anything. wearing leather armor, right? I believe so. You no, wearing anything just... else? Um, That's kind of kinky, bro. <laughs> <laughs> uh, can I have a robe? Like to cover you everything? A... I guess, I guess. Robe's pretty big. It's like a Kamoshida robe, Bryce. You just have like a hood and a cape type thing. Wow. If you want robe, sure. You walk up, robe. And he, he looks at you. Is your face covered or exposed? Um, the hood is partially over my head, but you can see my face. Okay. With shadow, but... And he looks at you, reaches out his hands, and says... He looks and he goes, I'm normally a great judge. But I can't tell this time, human or elf, as he reaches out his hand. I grab his hand, I shake, and I say, take your pick. <laughs> oh. oh. What is I'm whatever you want me to be. <laughs> Daddy? Oh, fuck. Showing, showing my, my tattoo of nobility on my right wrist. Now this is bulge. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> I show my... Big, I play a druid and I only transform into cats. <laughs> oh, whoa, what's this? Fucking right. listening to. Uh, he, he just had his hands, and as he as he looks at you more, he goes, Ah, a half-elf. We really don't get too many of you around here. Mostly they, they go on these high and mighty adventures when they think they're better than the rest of us. But clearly... Yeah, <laughs> clearly you're not better. That's not what I want to say. But clearly you know how to do an honest day's work. We're killing Brad. And he sits, and then you, you sit down in the chair. I say, I have my own agenda. Wow, everyone has their own agenda. That's kind of how people are, but okay. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> so then, what what exactly do you bring to the table? I, I'm getting a really big rogue vibe from you. We've thrown out like 15 rogues, because that seems to be all the only thing people are these days. Damn kids don't appreciate a, a good fighter. Right? A dude did a thing. I was reading a meme while Brian takes 20 years to fucking uh, respond. You're talking. To I'm not gonna there. interrupt you. Hey, start talking. <laughs> no. This is gonna be a long time. I use my charisma to say I will be of help. Just say it. So he said, "What do you bring to the What do you bring to the table as a rogue? An experienced dwarf like yourself should know an." A good rogue from a bad one. I also. I like wish it. not to. I wish not to uh, reveal my secrets quite yet. He looks at you up and down once again, and he thinks, "All right, I've been known to take risks. My brothers here say." <laughs> I had a thought. My my brothers here aren't too, aren't a big fan of rogues. Say they're all they're all just waiting to stab you in the back, but me. I like to take risks. And he reaches out his hand. Ten gold. Ten gold coins could be yours once the shipment reaches Fandolin. I ask for twenty. Twenty. <laughs> We're not made... Fandolin is, is a frontier town, son. Now, I know you're a half-elf, but I don't think you've been around as long as us. If you want the support of nobility, you will take... You never asked his name, by the way. <laughs> That's a good point. I forgot. He also never introduced himself. No, so do it, do it really at the end, Wait, 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 wait. Just, just let him get away with not asking me. I need to write it down so I know what to call you. No, 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 no. You guys oh, haven't actually great. met each other yet, currently. by the way. You've only watched other people give their interviews. My name is unknown. He won't realize until after he accepts me that he didn't. Alright, I, right, I don't, I don't know what will he do, Brian? Crazy. You Jerry, tell me, put but... that down. Put that down. Mm -hmm. Is that deep eddies? Yeah. I'm cutting you off. <laughs> it says, it's ten gold, son, or the door is that way. <laughs> hey, hypothetically, what happens if they don't Hypothetically, can we hurry the fuck up with this? I don't know, hypothetically, if uh, Brian would just talk. He asked the question. Hypothetically? Alright. Tunnels can't be caves. <laughs> Alright, ten, ten gold it is. <laughs> Alright. Finally, when he reaches out, shakes your hand, and he says, "I guess that was the last one, brothers. Let's start yeah, heading out. Oh, Do you want to, uh, you want to get their attention, Will, or are you just gonna sit there quietly?" Ow, oh, that one hurt. <laughs> I just gotta make things tough, huh? Of course. All right, fine. As Wait, they're walking, Will's bike's been working. Yeah, yeah. it's working. <laughs> 
as they're walking to the door, uh, Gundren is about to open it as one of his brothers, uh, p- like, tugs on his shirt and points to the corner. The dark corner is a hood... hood hooded hood rich. <laughs> hood... Hood shit. It's a hood, it's a hood shit. Hood rat sitting in the corner. Uh, <laughs> sitting in the corner, Racist. and uh, he 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 walks up. Uh, he walks up to him, right? Him. And he says, "So, the so a tiefling in Neverwinter. That's almost as rare as the dragonborn we hired. What's your story, friend? I don't know you, stranger." I'm not Goodbye. telling you my story. <laughs> not right now, Bryce. <laughs> Is that... So, well, you're clearly here for a reason. No one comes to this bar unless someone has a job posting. You looking for work? I am. I hate kids who don't fucking talk. Let's just have a one-word response. It's part of my backstory, Bryce. Yeah, what... what t- all right then. What type of work are you looking for? I can't even tell by looking at you what you do for a living. Put your tits away, kid. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's not that. It's not that session. Okay, sorry. I heal others' wounds for a price. Will price. Ah. Heal price. So are you one of those? Are you one of those warlocks, then? Huh? I, I know you. The Celestial's your divine deity? Not deity. Divine patron? That's the word. Patron. Uh, I worship Bahamut, but... No, I am not a warlock. I am he a seems player. almost taken aback by that, by that phrase. Bahamut. The dragon lord. You, t- yes. you look less dragon and more devilish than that. It is true. Good looks. <laughs> All right then, follower of Bahamut. How does ten gold pieces sound? Sounds great. Night. Lead, 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 lead me to my party. Uh, oh, hey guys, pretend like I said this to each of you. Uh, meet tomorrow at midday to set out on your adventure. <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> Sorry, boys, forgot about that. Uh, meet the rest of them. To- <laughs> meet the rest of them tomorrow. And then they, they, he, uh, Gundren walks over, flips the barman, uh, a gold piece, and then they exit through the door. That was your first introduction into the... So then you all spend the night somewhere. I don't <coughs> really care, uh, where you go. Uh, I'm, you are I'm also... In a brothel. All right, roll, hey, roll a d20 and use your constitution modifier. Bye, Who? Wait, Brian, no, Brian. Uh, you said the words. Just roll one. That's... Yeah, roll one d twenty. <laughs> I got a one. <laughs> Congratulations! <laughs> you have now been inflicted with uh, says it was a one, herpagonocyphalids. Oh my god! All at once, you now take twenty damage a second. Ow! Uh, you big yikes! I'm dead. Someone Peace. just died on the first night. Alright, uh, What did he try? <laughs> He went to a yeah. brothel. Yeah, yeah, he went to a brothel. Uh, I'm just joking, but be careful what you do. I might make you roll. Yeah, I'll, right. I'll do you the guys same. Want to talk to each other or? Nope. All right. I want no, no. Here, no. I'll make. I'll. Make, I'll, I'll be the one. So, I walk up to the man carrying three boxes at a time. Totally man. astounded that's by a, his. That's a dragon. dragon. His his big bulging arms. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like. Where'd you learn to get so strong, stranger? No, pause real quick. <laughs> we learned to get strong, Tyler. <laughs> you my, no- my noble See, status makes it so I don't have to dirty my hands with this like big word. Is that what you say to this human yes. thing? To this elf Friends standing guard in yeah. response. <laughs> I just scoff at him. I don't value nobility. You're useless to us. Oof, dang. Ooh. Call him out. I don't want to hear from the elven whore. <laughs> That's what you think. And I just walk away. She doesn't even have a shirt. <laughs> Shut the fuck up! I guess I do! Wait. Here's another thing. Y'all know each other's names? Yeah, I know. Because nobody else wanted to talk! I was the only one! 
I'm getting to that now. Wait, so right. what's Will's character's name? I ask what Will's character's name is. Yeah, you asked that. Like, what's Will's, David, char what's David, Will's David, character's like, name? What, when you meet someone in person, how do you figure out their name? <laughs> I was, uh, you ask. What's the name, bro? <laughs> okay. Do you want me to start this David, off? Uh, shut up, David. It's going to help you for later. Shut up! <laughs> Just yeah. roleplay. That's why roleplay voices work, because we don't have to guess when someone's not talking. Just talk. That's it. I'm not. A, I'm just ominous voice. Just talk. What? what what's your name? <laughs> Stranger. <laughs> Where you come from? All right. Do you, did you did you just say that out loud, or did you walk up to anybody and say it? Or did you just yeah. mutter it to yourself? <laughs> <laughs> what's your name? I'm walking up to Will. Up. Will's character. All right. You're walking up to the tiefling. Tiefling. Oh shit! My computer. Let's go to sleep? Yeah. <laughs> you see flames. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh, shit. Yeah. There's a bright light. Oh Why god. Why do you have a sleep timer on your computer? Who the fuck does that? <laughs> Why does it go like, off when you're in a call? Alone. I don't know. know. Alright, talk amongst yourselves. Come on. Will's character, what's your name? <laughs> Point! Talk! Be like, hey, who are you? Don't say Will's character! <laughs> Who the fuck are you? Hey, Tiefling, who are you? Yeah, you haven't- what? <laughs> David, you say, I walk up to Will's character and ask, Hey, oh, I walk name? up to Will's character. Who are you? Who the fuck are you? Tell me who you are. <laughs> Damn, that's aggressive. <laughs> this sounds like a crazy person. <laughs> <laughs> who are you? Alright, sorry, sorry, I won't interrupt. Continue the roleplay. Uh... More guy, who are you? <laughs> Admiral. <laughs> you, you come here often. <laughs> I get up. I walk to the other side of the cart. To up front next to the oxen. What? <laughs> I follow suit. Because I hear this conversation and I want no part of it. I'm just sitting around the campfire and looking dumb. And I give a friendly nod to, to the tiefling. I, s I walk over to Tyler's character and ask, Hey, what's your name, friend? I'm... After she already hit on you? Yeah, I didn't catch your name. Though. Yeah. Come on, Brian. Uh, pay maybe if you paid attention. Friend. I'm Unoi Gasag. Yasag. Right. I'm not going to remember that. <laughs> it's uh, O-N-U-Y. Just call him Annoying. Annoy is his name. Annoy. Annoy. Annoy? Annoy. Yasag. Am I pronouncing that right? Annoy? Yeah, it's okay. It's a odd name for a person like me, but eh. almost like it's backwards or something. <laughs> Shut up, Brian! <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna be a real problem if we get drunker. <laughs> you really just said it out loud. What? What? I just do. Hey, I have it on recording. <laughs> when Jerry gets famous, we'll hold it against him. <laughs> My name is King. Er, I wanna in front of run, everyone. I wanna run towards the sound of the break of tyranny. Of <laughs> sounds like hearing tyranny. me. What's that? Hey, David. What's your armor class? <laughs> oh no. God. Hey, David. What is Leather. your? No. What is your AC at the very top? There's a number where it says armor class. It's eleven. Hmm. That's lower than me. <laughs> Wait, I'm a wizard. It shouldn't be eleven. Dave, this modifier. Uh, what's it? Oh wait, it might be eleven. It was it minus one. My dexterity is plus zero. Oh no, nah, it's eleven. <laughs> oh my god. god! What the? Wait, Bryce, okay, did I say knock out? I did, right? The spring nope. is still you said on the shoot to thing. kill, and then if you yeah, don't kill, it does nerve damage. damage. So then the oh, arrow then goes straight bad. through the straight through the base of his skull. And out through the goblin's mouth, killing him instantaneously. <laughs> My bad. I no see mercy, this. Right? 
I, I, I'm watching this happen. The other ones, like for yeah. real. Yeah. One goblin has been obliterated. One <laughs> goblin had his throat stabbed and cut. The other goblin seppukued himself. And the last <laughs> goblin had an arrow shot from the base of his skull out his mouth. Okay. I see this, and I all I say is, "Wow, what a high noble this one is," in a sarcastic manner. Why do you talk? <laughs> I mean, I look at the elf good. and I say, "You're next." <laughs> Damn. Well, uh, I guess we just have to keep fucking going now. Okay, just okay I investigate the goblin I just killed. Okay. I rummage through his goods. It's a dead goblin. He has nothing of value on him. I fuck his ass. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I wanna roll a constitution check again? For some <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm okay. <laughs> no, no, no. Not sure? <laughs> are, we t are we taking trophies again? If you want to take trophies, the ears. I scalp the uh, closest scalp. <laughs> Jerry's a scalper for some reason. It's fine. Sure, you scalp a dead goblin. Real, real tough guy thing to do, man. A goblin. You basically scalp the child. I know. Scalp the next child, actually. That's gonna be a fun one. Uh.